Hey guys, I got a package in the mail and uh, this is the 9 bot Mini and we are going to upgrade it to the 9 bot Mini Pro by changing out this thing here which is the, the, the knee control and the hubcaps we're gonna also swap out so let's get started I got this one from China and as you can see Mini Pro, but no Segway logo. Because they were selling this uh, long before they imported it to to the US. So this was already being sold in, in China. And here goes the hubcaps. There's also some needed uh, tools for you. Here's the, the inserts and the screws. So you should be able to see this. This is you just need a knife and pry that open, and then it exposes that. There's four screws. This doesn't fit because it's not the same as the Pro. So I need a smaller one. There it goes. I'm gonna speed this up a little bit. So there are four screws on the outside. So the mini uses the in uh, the center ones and uh, the pro uses the, the exterior ones so you just line them up it clicks in actually okay so here they go and uh, you just mount them using the supplied allen wrench So now you need three of these, put them in any order and just snap them in. Oh, they're kind of um, tough and then you use one of these also. So there you go, one hub done and uh, let's turn it around. And we'll do this side too. Pop it out. Unscrew. Here are those snap-ons. Again, you can do them in any order. Now, uh, what's next? We have the non-adjustable uh, knee pad. I mean, the knee controller. So 
so we're just going to remove that. And uh, all you need to do is pop this cover off. Don't need any knife. Just pop it off like that. And then uh, they gave you a supplied Allen wrench and new screws. So all you need to do is. That's two, and it comes right off. So, here's a comparison. Right? So, that's the difference. Uh, this one still has. English and Chinese on it, but this one only has Chinese. So, yeah. Now we're gonna put it on. So for this, you just need to undo this. Or well, you could leave it on, I suppose, but I think it's easier if we undo it. Take this part out. just goes in like this. Take the two supplied screws, the new ones. They're, about, they're the same. I mean these are the new ones with the blue marking on it and this one already, you know, these are old screws. And, uh, I'll just keep it, uh, I'll just keep using the new ones. To tighten these uh, really well so that it doesn't uh, come loose. Uh, on my 9 Bat Pro, it's loose, so all right, that's tight. And here goes the stop. Put it on, and then you snap it on. And that's it. We're done. Oh, forgot this one last piece which they give you, which is this rubber thing. So, just shove it in there. Did I put it in upside down? I guess so. Could be. Yeah, I did. It's supposed to go in like this. So yeah, that's it. If you can tell, it is the 9 bot Mini. And uh, yeah, see that? This still has a Chinese uh, do not remove label. And this is it. You can see that it's now the Pro. So that's uh, that's it. I think because the stock is is uh, different weight, I have to recalibrate it. So I recalibrate using the app so that it doesn't uh, move. There it goes. It's calibrated. So there it goes. The completed Segway upgrade so now it's the pro <laughs> pretty nice I'm gonna try to ride it and uh, give it a go around but here I am in the new upgraded one works fine mm -hmm. Thank you.
And just to show you, it is the 9 part mini. And you can see right here. It is the original 9 part mini. And it has been upgraded to the Pro. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, please like and subscribe.